Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Canada Bourbon Group. Hey guys, in today's video, I'm going to be opening this box of shoes because I think I have a small addiction with shoes. So yeah, guys, basketball season is over. There should be um, a video once a week. That is my goal. One every week or every two weeks around there. If you enjoy this video, please leave a like. And yeah, let's get right into it. So if you guys didn't know, I was previously using LeBron 15 Lows as my basketball shoes since the summer now, so not that long. But I'm just not the biggest fan of them. So when I saw this deal, I just couldn't pass up. I got this shoe. It's originally 140. Then it was on sale for 115. Then it, there's another like coupon code for 25% off to make them $86 plus shipping, $94. For this. Okay. You guys might be able to tell from the box what these are. Bada bang, bada boom. That's weird. These are already used. It's disgusting. The hair right there. And you could see where like someone put like the dirty sock marks. They still smell new, but they weren't like stuffed with anything, so somebody definitely tried this on. Like, you can see like on the bottom. Not the cleanest thing that I've ever seen. Kinda disappointed, not gonna lie. All like creased right here. Here's the shoe, James uh, Harden, Volume 3. I'm gonna go have a mental breakdown, and I'll get back to you guys. Yeah, so I've decided what I'm going to be doing is sucking it up and just trying them on anyways. But yeah, you guys could- it's obviously they're not even like dead stock lace, you know? How they come like with the looped. Um, these are already tied. These have obviously been tried on. There's like, the thing that's grossing me out is there's tiny hairs everywhere. But I'm just gonna ignore that and start talking about the shoe. So the reason I got this was because the reviews of this were phenomenal. Um, great traction. The cushion was um, low profile but still like really there because it's boost obviously. Uh, this is my first Adidas basketball shoe. So I'm excited uh, about the build quality, like the first impressions. Um, there's like glue like marks a little bit. But yeah, I'm just gonna put some socks on, try them on, see how they fit. Hopefully they do fit, or else these are going to be returned once again because somebody clearly wore them. I can't be bothered to put basketball socks on right now, so I'm just gonna put these. No wonder they came so fast. I ordered them Wednesday night, and I got them today, which is Friday morning. It's not even like 12 o'clock yet, so hopefully I don't get four dates from this. Alright, they fit. Thing, I tried these on in store once before. Um, the thing that I'm worried about the most is that it cuts down super low right here and then goes really high, but I feel like my foot will kind of like slip out a lot. But they do have the cat tongue material to try and avoid that, but it does bring your sock down, so I don't know. It says lucky on the inside of the tongue, so I hope they are lucky. I don't like to tie my shoes over and over again. Yes, I'm that lazy. All right, we got both shoes on. I'm gonna stand up. All right. After trying them on and looking in the mirror and stuff, I do like them. Um, I like the way they feel. They're very like comfortable, but I'm lower to the ground. My, the one thing I didn't like, well, there's many things I didn't like about my LeBrons, but I was very high up and I don't like that. Um, I know it makes me taller, but I can tell one thing that I'm already noticing in these is that my socks are going to get pulled down like crazy. They look kind of funky, but they like really like close my foot. They're pretty comfortable. Um, these are, again, just my first impressions. Kind of mad about champs and the condition that I receive these in. I mean, they're basketball shoes, they're gonna get dirty anyways, so. I'm excited to play in these, I'm gonna see. The earliest I can play in these is Wednesday. This strap looks a lot more flexible in like pictures and videos, cause it is not really, it's like pretty, pretty like thick and there. But I have a good feeling about them. If you guys do wanna like know my opinions after I start playing on them, um, I might make a video, or if you can just comment down below and I'll respond to your comment once I do play in them. I just want to let you guys know that my taste in basketball shoes is low because I, again, I don't like to tie them over and over again, so I get low shoes. Um, traction is probably the number one most important thing for me. I don't know why, but, well, I do know why because I appreciate standing on my feet and not slipping all over the ground, but it's just, like, really important to me. Like, the LeBron 15 was, like, cushion heaven, or it was supposed to be because it had the Air Max unit in the back and then it had the, um, Lunar Lawn thick midsole. They're in the wash right now. I'm already a fan of Adidas Boost. Um, these are so dusty. I'm sorry. I'm sorry about these. Already a big fan of Adidas, Adidas Boost, so I knew that the cushion would probably most likely uh, be good for me. These are my favorite shoes I've ever played in. The traction was really good. Like, only, like, I've played in them for about two years, and 
only like toward like the back end of its like run that I had to start like wiping. Like I didn't even know what wiping was before. So. And I mean they were $94, um, which is good. Glad I got a good, you know, amount of dollars off. Amount of dollars off. So I don't really follow James Harden that much or like, yeah, or the NBA. For the hell that matter, I don't like watching NBA. I think it's unrealistic to the level of basketball that I'm playing right now. So, um, if you guys know any like secret like messages behind the shoe, or not messages, but like, you know, like little like gems, like details that he put in. Like Kobe has the spade thing. Um, on the other shoe, there's like the Achilles. Cool things like that. Please comment down below and I will like your comment and like respond. You know, maybe subscribe if your channel's good. Um, so do that. Guys, with that being said, that is all I have for you. Um, thank you guys for all the love on the channel recently. Um, and with that being said, thank you guys all for watching and I'll see you guys next time.